I'm now going to show you how to roast a lobster in this little beauty. It's the cage. Lobsters, prawns, their tail's always like this because that's how they get around, basically. But it means that the muscle tissue under here is stronger than, than around the top because it contracts, contracts, contracts. So to soften it, to actually stretch the fibres, what I'm going to do is put the lobster in the cage to bend the tail back. So I've just taken the claws off and just set them aside for the, mo for the moment. And I want to get the rod through the tail and the head. So now you can see, when I clamp that down, I've been able to bend the tail backwards, which should stretch the muscles here, make the lobster more tender. Uh, so now I'm gonna put, pop these back in, just probably some thyme, lemon slices, a few garlic cloves in. And now I'll just put the lid of the cage on. Okay, pop this over the coals. and press the button. There's so many things you can do in here. You could put a whole chicken in there, you just flatten it down. It opens up a whole new world of ideas for cooking this way. And what this barbecue does, it allows you to play around and sort of control the fire. As well as cooking, you can actually use it to rest food or keep food warm, even while you're grilling underneath. See, now that looks like that's nicely cooked. I love that, I love that smell, love it. As you can see, the lobster tail is now flat. You can see actually how this has stretched the fibres. It's so unbelievably tender, yet it's still holding moisture. Thank you.